Hey guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to I just felt like vlogging. I was like, you know what? I have an agenda today and so what's the agenda you might ask um so my mom and I on Saturday it's supposed to be a super like rainy day and we're like you know what let's have like a little St. Patrick's Day craft day because um St. Patrick's Day is next weekend but Bobby will be in town so I'll be hanging out with her so we're gonna do it this weekend and I was like you know what that sounds like so much fun we did it at christmas we made ornaments and let me tell you it was so much fun so we're gonna do it now for saint patrick's day but i just want to see if i can find any like last minute like fun things to go along with like our craft you know to either put on the table or like little plates or little anyways just something and i just feel like walking around even if i don't buy anything i just feel like walking around stores is fun so that's what i'm gonna do and so and so that means you guys are gonna come with me because I'm vlogging. And yeah, so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna do that, and let's go ahead and go in. Our first stop is a little store called Pop Shelf, which is like a five below, and I discovered it when I was going shopping for my apartment. It's actually, it's kind of a special place because um, the first thing that I ever bought for my own place was forks from there, and they were like, yeah, I got like a whole set of forks um, and I manifested that apartment. I, I literally, um, I, <laughs> I put in my application and like before I even knew I had that apartment, I had gone here and it's just kind of sentimental because I bought them and I was like, you know what? I'm going to manifest that I'm going to, I'm going to use these forks in my new apartment. And then I got the call a couple days later that I had the apartment and I was approved and all that. So Anyways, we're gonna go on Pop Shelf and then we're gonna go to some other stores. Look how cute this is, oh my gosh. I love it. For some like jelly beans, $8, that's not bad. Like the little Easter trees, how cute. Oh, this is really, really cute. I love it. $10, that's not bad. Look at the little like tulip tea lights. Oh my gosh, I love. This is, this is super, super cute, but I just like would use it once and it's $5. I don't know. Now this, cutie, I'm gonna get it. Guys, the bunnies are so cutie and they're scented. They smell like jelly beans kinda. I love them, oh my God. All right, I'm in Marshalls now and look, they even have a little cookie cutter that comes with these. How adorable. They literally have so many cute kitchen towels. It's insane. Guys, there's so many cute crewnecks right now. Like, oh my God, that's adorable. Look at this shirt with the little cats with their little cups. Oh my god, it is really cute. It would be hard to style, but I kind of like love it. Oh, you guys, look at this dress and it has like a little slit. Oh, that is so beautiful. Guys, literally all these dresses are so pretty. Um, I'm very, very much drawn to this one. Like, I love it. I am obsessed with little sleep sets, mm -hmm. especially ones with shorts. Like, I would rather sleep in shorts mm -hmm. than pants. Like, I'm obsessed. Listen, I have the cat shirt in my hand to purchase and I just think that I have a vision for it. Like black ripped jeans, um, a black bodysuit underneath and like I got it a size up so it would be like oversized. I don't know. I can always return it if it's ugly, if my vision's ugly. But I kind of, I think it might be cute. Like I can't resist it. You know how you, sometimes you just see stuff? Like... It's just so cute. Like, I, I need to give it a fair try before I, like, I don't know. Okay, update. I did purchase that cat shirt, and I <laughs> I want to try it on in this vlog and see how the vision is. We'll see together. Like I said, it might be hideous. However, now, you know, I'm going to take you guys to Hallmark. And I'm going to take you guys to Hallmark because I want to look at the jelly cats. And I want to tell you which ones I'm, like, eyeing right now. Am I going to buy any of them right now? Why are my glasses fogging up? Help? Um, no, probably not. I do have a couple coupons. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. But I just want to go look at them. Like, it just brings me so much joy to look at jelly cats. So we're going to go do that right now. I'm so excited. Guys, look how cutie the turtle is. Um, they've gotten some new ones. This one is new in here. I haven't seen this one in person before. The little hedgehog. Oh my gosh. 
the line is making me think of uh, the New Heights podcast when Travis just said that him and Taylor were taking a picture with a lion <laughs> at the Sydney Zoo and it like got off its perch. I'm, I'm, this was so cute. Look at the freaking coffee keychain. I'm standing. The little bee is even cute. The boba. The teak pot is adorable. Um, and I've been eyeing this potato for a hot minute now, literally since Emma's been here. Guys, I feel like I'm in a cave. This one with the coloring just gives me debut vibes. I don't know, guys, I kind of really want it. Guys, I didn't leave Hallmark without a uh, jelly cat. This one just gave me debut vibes. Like, look at the greens and look at the blues. Look, it's been a bit of a week, if I'm being honest. So, <laughs> I deserved a jelly cat. I'm not mad at myself at all. Um, so, I mean, do I, have I told myself I need to save money? Yes. Um, can I justify a little jelly cat here and there? Yes. Mm-hmm. But, <laughs> I, I really, I just wanted it. And like, um, as silly as it sounds like debut, oh my gosh, the sun is like, right um as silly as it sounds it reminded me of debut taylor and debut taylor has been like i don't know it was it was the first album that ever made me feel like understood by music and i always feel myself like gravitating towards debut so anyways leave it to a jelly cat to make me feel sentimental about taylor but Anyways, I'm gonna go and Hobby Lobby and get some like little paint brushes and stuff for this weekend because I got like these little ceramic, um, like they're like little leprechauns and my mom and I are gonna paint them. I might vlog on Saturday. I might just vlog, we will see. But um, I'm so excited regardless. And um, so I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby and get some like little brushes and just look around. You guys know me. Why wow, my glasses look really dirty? <laughs> what is happening? You guys want the real, you want the real Rachel Meyer right now. I uh, pulled him to this parking spot and added Taylor's whole discography. By the way, I'm changing my little car scent. This one I got because of Midnight's. Um, I just looked up and there was still like a snowflake one. I was like, I need to change that. Anyways, I keep my little car scents handy in here. Anyways, so um, the fresh balsam is, it's time to retire her. Um, so, I was listening to Taylor and you guys probably can't even hear anything I just said because of the uh, air and Cruel Summer live from the Eras tour came on and I started bawling just swifty things um, so I am tears streaming down my face right I look up in the car in front of me there is someone just chilling in their car just like I'm doing and so, if that wasn't humbling on a Thursday afternoon, this one smells so good. The coconut sandalwood is my favorite scent from Bath & Body. Um, it has a sandalwood scent to it and it smells like so much like one of Taylor's favorite perfumes with like a hint of coconut. So, um, yeah, the lighting's awful, but I will be including this clip in because um, just swifty things, like I'm sure I have tear stains. Like I said, um, anyways, we're gonna go into Hobby Lobby now that I've really humbled myself in the parking lot. You guys, so cute. I got this one when Emma was here, but this one, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, they're so vintage and cute. Oh, I'm obsessed. These eggs are also beyond gorgeous. Like, are you, oh my God, I love. Oh, you guys, this is so, so cutie. Oh my God. All right, you guys, I am home now. And let me just say, if anybody was next to me in traffic, they definitely got a show. It was one of those days um, where I just like, every single Taylor song that came on was making me so emotional. Like the best day came on and like my mom has always been my best friend and like I just, I just was like, oh my God. And it just hit me with like a ton of bricks. Um, and then Love Story came on, which is like the song that like made me fall in love with Taylor and like then I like never look back like I hit play on that song a million times and I'll hit play on it a million more times because like that song truly like just like truly changed my life like it's crazy um anyways it's me hi I'm the emotional Swifty today 
Um, so I wanted to do a little haul for you guys. I'm gonna style that <laughs> that cat shirt for you guys before this vlog is over. So I don't know why I'm hyping it up so much. Like, I don't know. I'm just so anxious to see like if my vision is visioning. Um, so first we went to Pop Show. I've never had this big of a bag. Everywhere was so crowded, by the way. Like, I was like, oh, I'm gonna like vlog so much. And then like everywhere was so crowded. So I tried. Um, I did get this adorable doormat. Let me just say, I have never spent over $10 for a doormat. My doormat that I got like fall, and it was so cute, was $5 from Five Below. And this was $10. I just think it, oh, it has some mark on it. But I did see that. It was the last one. I didn't really like the other one they had. This is adorable. Um, I just, I think it's so freaking cute. Okay, I cannot wait to use that. Um, so I filmed a vlog. I have not finished said vlog of me decorating for St. Patrick's Day and Easter. I, I have everything done for that vlog, except... <laughs> showing you guys all my Easter decorations and my like St. Patrick's Day decorations because by the time um, that I finished, it was like too dark in my apartment. I wanted to show you guys in good lighting. So, and it's been so like rainy and dreary here. So every time I went to go film it, it's just been like the vibes were like off to like show you guys my Easter decor. Um, so stay tuned because when it's, when it's better lighting, trust, I'll finish it. Um, and then I picked this up for a dollar. My cat is going to tear this to shreds in a minute. So this is probably more of a toy for her than it is like a little decoration for the table. But um, it's just these little like shamrocks and you can kind of just like, you know. But I thought it was really cute for a for dollar. I went ahead and grabbed it. Um, and let's see. I got these little shamrock plates. I think there's like, I don't know how many plates there is, eight. And there were three dollars. I thought they'd be cute to like put um, my mom and I's like little paint brushes on or like all the little paints on. Cause like I said, I got us that little leprechaun um, ceramic. I can show you guys, how about that? So I got so excited last night and like pulled all like my little paints and stuff out. But these are the ones that I got. They're so adorable. Um, they're like little leprechaun gnomes and I thought they'd be so fun to like paint, just chill out and have like a a fun day um anyways so then I put all my little paints in here but I had to go to Hobby Lobby and get new paint brushes because <clears throat> the other ones were just so like saturated with paint that it was time for some new ones I do clean my paint brushes but I used them a lot for like Eras tour 2023 stuff and they just like it was it was time um so i went to hobby lobby and i bought more than these beautiful paint brushes they look look they're the color of the rainbow too like i don't know i'm such a theme person i'm like oh my god like that's so cute like saint patrick's day like a rainbow luck of the irish like i just thought it was cute anyways so um i bought this little towel i'm gonna put this in my bathroom i so i have these towels here on my on my oven just hanging i love it so i bought this for my bathroom it says kitchen towel but who cares um oh my god i could not pass it up like i'm so sorry i look like a crazy cat lady but i don't really care that's the thing rachel's not caring um and then i did get these beads they're spacers and Emma and I were both looking, I took her to my Hobby Lobby um, when she came and we were both looking for some spacers, but we didn't find any, but they had them today. And I went ahead and grabbed them because they have like little hearts. They have little stars, like circles, little like just squares, little diamonds and circles. So this was not bad for $10.99 I feel. And I know we'll be using them, especially when she comes for Tortured Poets. I'm so excited. Guys, when I tell you Emma and I are counting down the days, I mean it. Um, and then I did get this little, look, it's so cute. It'll be so cute in like, you know, my room or something like that. It's just so vintage. You guys know I love vintage things. And that was, this was 40% off. 
And then also the, let's see. Oh, this was 40% off. So I could justify it. But I thought they were really cute. And yes, I did get a new jelly cat. Mm -hmm. And it's so cute. Like I am, I just, I, I always check for, look, I sound, I sound so grandma right now, but I always, I always check. I always check and make sure, oh, is there like a little coupon at the bottom of your receipt? Like, yes, I am that person. I have turned into that person. I have coupons in my drawer right here. Yeah, um, I am her. Uh, anyways, <laughs> I got this little bunny and I'm just gonna set it on my couch or on my bed. And it just, it gives me debut. I'm so sorry, like I, I was so drawn to it. Like I said, um, debut Taylor is so special to me because that is the Taylor that has been my best friend the very longest. That is the first album, like I said, that ever made me feel so understood by music. And uh, it's just so impactful to me. Like the songs like The Outside, like I, I could just go on a rant how much I love that album um, and how much I'm going to sob when Taylor's version comes out, but um, anyways, conclusion, I got the rabbit. I got the little bunny and I just adore it. Okay. Then at Marshall's, I did get this orange dress. I think it's gorgeous. I am quite obsessed. I think it'll be so, so cute in the summer. Um, for like, maybe like, I don't know, some festivity. Who knows what the festivity will be, but we'll find an occasion. And then this look. <laughs> I didn't really get to show you guys like in detail. Yeah, this is looking oh, like it's, it's sipping tea. Like, come on, how was I not supposed to buy this? Or at least like give it a go. Trust me, the thing about me is I will return and it's like it's, it's high low. So like it's longer in the back than the front, which is so cute. Like with some baggy jeans, I don't know. I'm kind of feeling the vision, but we'll see the vision together or not, but um, I just wanted to at least give it a try. So sometimes like you see stuff like that and you're like, mm, I don't know, but that's why you keep your receipt because I am the person who will be returning it if it does not work. So um, anyways, you guys, I'm gonna eat and then I will get back to you guys when I'm ready to try that stuff on. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, we just as friends, I'll understand too. Oh, I've done so much since I talked to you guys. So I ate dinner and I had a coffee and I vacuumed. I cleaned up Jazzy, not, she's not messy, but you know how it is having a cat. And um, she's shedding so bad right now. So she, yeah, she has like little fur, fur balls all over the place. Um, it's okay. I love you and I'd do anything for you, my fur baby. Um, I like can't imagine not having a pet. Um, but anyways, <laughs> really? Like cats are so finicky. You just saw, she was like, oh, like I wanna be pet and now she's like, has an attitude. Anyways, um, not me moving away. Yes, ma'am, this is your couch, you're right. So I did my cat mom duties and then I vacuumed. I wiped down all my countertops, like my table, all my surfaces um, in my apartment. And then I cleaned my bathroom and I wiped down like my mirror and my bathroom. Like I, I was on a cleaning spree. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I've gotten a lot done. And then I decided to like set up um, my mom and I's little craft bucket for Saturday and so yeah I might vlog I really 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 might I know I already said it and then I was bopping to Bryn Cartelli's album now listen we need to have a conversation because um Bryn is so incredibly talented she was on The Voice and um I discovered her when Girl Code came out and Emma and I have always like ever since we heard Girl Code we were like hyped for every single release like convertible in the rain like um secondhand smoke like we were so excited and when she said that she was coming out with her album out of the blue i was like finally we're getting a brand album like and i have been playing it non 
freaking stop. Like it has been on repeat since it came out on Friday. Like, um, I have so many favorites. One of my favorites, I think my favorite is running in place. I'm obsessed, but Emma and I were just talking. I was like, Emma, like what's your, what's your top three? And she was like, I, that's a really hard question. Cause like, I have no idea. Um, and so yeah, we're, we're like, the whole thing's so good. Like Gemini is incredible. If you guys have not listened to Bryn Cartelli, definitely give her a listen. She is incredible. Like I am here to say it is on candid camera. I was a Bryn Cartelli fan before she became so superstar status. Like I am obsessed with her. Um, like if she were to like do a tour or something, I would definitely make it a point to go. Um, so yeah, you guys, I feel like whenever I sit, like 90% of the time, my couch looks like, you know, all the blankets are folded and everything. But whenever I seem to film, my couch looks like a disaster from the back, but it's just because I love having blankets on my couch. And yes, I did sit on my couch and I ate dinner and watched YouTube. So that's why the blankets aren't folded. Pardon me, but my whole apartment is very clean right now. And I love like when it just like, it's so refreshing to clean. Like it just, it smells so clean. And like, I always, I don't know, ever since I moved into my apartment, I've just like loved cleaning even more so. Like I've just loved like keeping everything straight. Like even like putting my laundry away. Like I just have like so much more space and I'm so like thankful. And I don't know, I'm just like, I've become my mom because my mom loves to vacuum and she like, like, I'm sorry. Like I've become the person I'm like, okay, how much am I going to pick up off this carpet? Like you don't realize like she sheds so much. And <laughs> anyways, this is probably appealing to one person watching this, but, um, it's just so interesting. Like where did all this fur come from? You know, anyways. That's my little cleaning spiel. Like, I just, I don't know. I really enjoyed it. It's kind of like therapeutic to just kind of like, you know, do your thing, listen to music. Um, but yeah, let me show you the little setup that I have going on for my mom and I on Saturday. And then I'm going to try my outfits on. And then I'm going to get in the shower and chill. But let me show you that first. Okay, so here's what I've got going on. I've just got this little, um, you know, decoration that I got. And then I got these little plates and I decided to set the little gnome leprechauns on them and then all our paints and our paint brushes. So I think it's super cute. All right, it's time to try these on now. I am so excited to see about this cat shirt. Here's what I got going on for the fit. Um, I have this black bodysuit on and I love this bodysuit. I got this from Old Navy. Um, and then these pants at a shop called Versona that no longer exists in my location. But, why do I kind of like it? It kind of looks like, no offense to myself, but it kind of looks like I'm about to go to the local SPCA and like, you know, hey, I'm here to help you adopt a cat. Um, but that's not a bad thing. Like, I've definitely considered volunteering there before. Um, I kind of like it. Like, like, I would wear it open like this, just like this. Like. I would just wear it like this and it has little cats on it. Listen, I kind of was like hoping that it would be the kind of vibe. I was going for the vibe where I like could like slouch it off my shoulder. Actually, hold on a second. Styling with Rachel. Um, I don't know why I kind of like it. Like if I just wore it kind of like, you know, I'm trying to be, you know, like, Kind of like just a slouchy shirt, if that makes sense, because I would want like the, I don't know, should I keep it? Does it look goofy? Actually, probably. Um, but like, it's so cute that like, I don't know, like these cats on it are so cute. And like, you know, like with a little necklace, I feel like this could be cute. And I like how long it is in the back. Like, look at this. Like, it's so much longer in the back than, like, the front. And I think that's so cute. Like, but my, my thing is, 
how many times would I wear this? You know, like when I buy something, I try and think how many times would I actually wear this? Um, you know, but like, I kind of feel like it's kind of cute, kind of different. Like, I don't know, somebody respectfully and be nice, tell me below. Like, is this giving or is it giving return it, you know? Um, I kind of think it's kind of fun and it's not like excessive. It's kind of just like there, you know? What if I wore this on Tortured Poets release day? Wait, wait, hmm, what do you guys think? Somebody tell me, I need fashion advice. Um, and like I said, please be nice to me. <sighs> Cause I'm sitting here and I'm like, I don't know about this, but like, hold on. Could I see myself in Target like this, you know? Like, like, you know, like, and I'm gonna kind of say yes, because at that point, it's gonna be kind of like warmish where I am. Okay, hold on. My fashion consultant, not that we have the same fashion sense, but Emma will tell me if it's ugly or not. And I know what she's gonna say. Actually, maybe not. But like, I feel like this could actually kind of be cute for tortured poets because I don't know what the style exactly is gonna be. Like Taylor's been wearing like corsets and like, you know, that kind of vibe. But like, I feel like this is kind of like, you know, like, like imagine, like I try to pick like the album that has like the most similar colors, you know, like, like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, and Taylor loves cats, you know? We're gonna FaceTime Emma. Let's see what she thinks about my potential Tortured Poets release day outfit. You, oh God, I know what you're gonna say. All right, don't make fun of it. All right, here, here, here's what we got. Now, <laughs> I know, why are you looking at me like that? That's cute. Guys, did you hear that? I really didn't think she was gonna say that. Okay, but it has little cats on it. Can you see this? Okay, I mean, that's, that's so cute. Do you like it? Should I keep this? Yeah. I really thought she was gonna call me a grandma. Really? Do you think this is really cute? Like, the, the shirt, like, like the shirt is like, uh, it's not my, like, it's not, the, it looks, the whole outfit looks cute on you. Like, it really does. The shirt, it's giving a little bit grandma, but it's good. But it's like not ugly, right? Like, it's not like. No, it's not ugly. The more I look at it, the more I'm like, this is kind of perfect for tortured poets. Like, this. When I was thinking about this, I was thinking of the little black paw prints like that they've been posting, it's me high, yeah. with the little, the little black paw prints. And I'm like, hmm, cats, it's Taylor Swift. It's cute. I mean, I might find something better. And yes, I do look like a grandma, but like, this is kind like, of- Like, you don't, like you look cute. Like the shirt, like it's, it's giving, it's, the shirt is like, the cat shirt is a little bit, like there's just the style of it is a little bit like, weird but i can also like throw it like this yeah i have the taylor swift zoomies all of a sudden i need you guys to tell me what you guys think should i wear this and i'm i might find something else honestly it's just that i'm so excited about <laughs> tortured poets coming out that i'm like this is what i'm gonna wear i might wear this though honestly like i love this bodysuit i love these jeans and I can't figure out what the vibe is yet for like the style per se of the album. Um, so I can't figure out what the style is of the album yet, you know, other than like what Taylor's been wearing recently. So I don't know, Emma didn't call it ugly. So we're, that's kind of like, we're getting somewhere, but I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching and uh, just coming with me today while shopping and you know, yes, I did get emotional over Taylor, but we were also productive and we may have found a release day outfit. So it's a win. I love you guys so much. I hope this video entertained you in some way. Thank you guys for just being interested in my life. And I love you guys. I hope this video entertained you and I hope to see you. Yes, you in the next one. Bye guys.